okay now let's see how to work with the nesting of the layouts how you are going to insert one layout into another layout we'll see so in our existing code I just want to show you so how nesting would be working so here what I, I'll do is that this layouts source main resource so in the layout what I am going to do is that new layout resource file say nested underscore layout nested underscore layout and say okay see yes see this thing linear layout is there so what I want to do is that at the center there would be image like this and at the bottom there would be buttons like this three buttons how it be creating this layout or at the center there would be one image like this over here icon and here username and password right there would be username and password how this thing would be working so instead of linear layout I can say relative layout if you see there would be the relative layout orientation width height match parent so in the relative layout you don't need orientation okay here what I would be doing is that one edit text like this say match parent and the wrap content so you would be having one text box over here can you see that text box and to that text box also I would be having one linear layout instead of wrap content you can say match parent and height also wrap content like this so inside this I would be having something this edit text right hint you can provide intention of this edit text say username so this edit text is going to be used for the username and here what I'm going to do is that I will give the padding from all four sides that's why only padding say 10 dp you can give padding like this so this is one edit text this is another edit text let me have another edit text say match parent match parent and you can say password see you haven't provided what you can say you haven't provided orientation it is giving me the error see the orientation vertical presently by default it is horizontal right now here what I want to username and password that's it but I want this to be at the center I want this to be at the center so to this linear layout you can say center in parent true that will come exactly at the center above this I want to have one image view right above this I want to have one image view you can say image view wrap content and the wrap content but it should be above let me give this ID ID say inputs say edities edities layout right edit layout or edities layout above this means this image view should be below your linear layout because this is going to get initialized after the linear layout and you can say to above or say above <coughs> at ID edities and just give the src I will use this ID underscore launcher IC underscore launcher above the this thing now I want to pull at the center center in parent true that's it so it would be coming at the center so instead of this what I will do is that let me get this save image as you can say desktop like this so we have code cool dot png at the desktop so let me get this into the my project layouts source main resources and in the drawable you can paste it like this say finish 
and instead of this MIP map, see you are referring right at MIP map. You are referring to the MIP map class in the R file at drawable. You are referring to the drawable class inside R file. See code cool, code cool, right? So you can have some margin top, sorry margin bottom. Say 30 SP. Can you see it is going upward? 50 SP. It is going again at the top. Right. Okay. Now I would be having one button here. Again, I would be having one linear layout, series of button linear layout, match parent, and the wrap content. Right. And align this to the bottom. Align parent bottom you can say true over here and say orientation and horizontal I want to align all the buttons horizontally yes and into this button wrap content wrap content I got one button you can assign text as login right you would be having another button as password uh, sorry register login and the register right and what I want to do is that these two buttons should be at the center now I will use the gravity right over here gravity center center in the layout so if you think that the distance between this and distance between this linear layout and distance between this is very high if you want to mix or if you want to reduce the distance instead of align parent bottom right so remove the align parent bottom over here and just say below below what edt layouts username and password are you getting this thing so your layout will look like this so what I will do is that so instead of see I'm going to go to the activity now and instead of this I can provide any layout absolutely over here right I can say nested layout fine what's the problem now let me run the code and see how it look likes so you will see one clean app screen over here fundamental screen see what I did nesting of the layouts right what I did nesting of the layouts if you can check it so we have one root layout that is relative layout into that we have one center layout that is nothing but for two edit text then above that we have one image view above this center layout we have an image view and again below that center layout we have buttons which will look like this now provide the functionality is your job on the click of login this no Android says that instead of wasting memory on the labels use hints that's why Android has given you the hints so it is not like the swing programming in the Java or label then text box label then text box instead of that use the hints like this username and the password are the hints to the user user will come to know what's the intention of this text box right yes guest guest login fine over here guest login right so this is about what you can say the layouts nesting of the layouts this is nothing but what nesting of the layouts this is how you are going to create nested layouts anything now you can provide the functionality login and the register and write that code over here that's fine right so this is how nesting of the layout any layout can be nested linear layout inside linear layout relative layout inside linear layout linear layout inside relative layout fine you can nest anything as per your need right now next thing related to the layout is nothing but what weight attribute how you are going to assign the weight we'll see that thing in the next tutorial how we are going to provide weight to the linear layout likewise the gravity either height or the width is going to be decided at the runtime we'll see how that works in the case of wait in next tutorial
thanks a lot for watching and if you like our videos kindly subscribe us and provide the likes okay